Hello everybody, welcome to Hillbilly Select Reviews. My name is John. I review, if you're new here, everything I do. Wines, beers, liquors, liqueurs, everything. Now, I also do my world famous coffee reviews on Sunday. I have playlists to break everything down so easy. If you're going somewhere for dinner, you're hosting a party, or you're looking for gifts, I have it all. Everything you need to know is here. But now I'm doing a little series of non-alcoholic drinks. And today's is going to be on their playlist is Hairless Dog Brewing Company. Right? Some of the alcohol, non-alcoholic beers I've been doing were 0.05%, 0.02%. This is the first one that's actually zero, zero. Uh, ABV. Um, rich, dark, smooth. Let me see. It might not have the hair, but it has the bite. We made NA, non alcohol, the right way. 0.0% alcohol, but 100% of the flavor. Craft beer lovers love um, and can keep on loving because sometimes you want to party like there's no tomorrow. Uh, a lot of applications for non-alcoholic beer there is, but what we want to know here is: Does it look like beer? Does it smell like beer? Does it taste like beer? That's the thing. And if it doesn't taste like beer, is it at least as a good beverage? Is it terrible? Let's see. Let's see what we have. So, all right. What is this? If I will look here. Oh, it's nice and dark. Look at that. That color is beautiful. Look at the head. Huh? Looks like beer. 100% looks like beer. We just got that going for it. So as that head goes down, I want to do it on purpose. Um, Minneapolis, Minnesota. That's where it's made. All right. There it is. Nice dark red. Look at that baby. Man, it looks appealing. Look at the head. Very nice. So far, so good. Okay. It smells like beer. What do I mean it smells like beer? It is. Slightly hoppy smell. You get the floral, piney type smell of hops. Slight, very slight. Malty, biscuity. Looks like beer, smells like beer. <laughs> Here's the most important part of all. Hmm. It's reminiscent of a um, Guinness. I don't know what style it's supposed to be, but it has that Guinness taste, sort of. It's not Guinness. It's not as smooth and as creamy and as flavorful, but it has that toasted, roasted malt um, taste. Little sourness to it, which Guinness doesn't necessarily have. I'm not saying it's Guinness or it's taken. It reminds me of it. That's what I'm saying. And Guinness is beer, and so. Not a Guinness, just if you drink, you know, have consumed some Guinness, it's reminiscent of some of that flavor. Guinness is better, um, but it's got alcohol, it's a lot heavier, and so on and so forth. Uh, this is a thin, uh, it's thin in the mouth, like water. Uh, it does look like beer, it does smell like beer, it does taste like beer. Um, not as flavorful. Slightly, slightly, uh, almost no bitterness whatsoever. What you might like, a little sourness, a little bitterness on the back end. So a little bit of hoppy smell, a little bit of hoppy flavor, very little. A little bit of sourness, a little reminiscent of the roasted malts of a Guinness. Um, 
Does it hit the mark? The answer is yes. Uh, it, it tastes like a beer. Looks like a beer. It smells like a beer. A rather weak one, a little bit watery, but you're getting no alcohol. Okay, you're compromising. So you are compromising on some flavor, some smell, some mouthfeel, but you're getting no alcohol, and it's close enough for governor work. All right. But then again, what isn't close enough for government? So, don't forget to subscribe. Check out my playlist. I'll have my non-alcoholic playlist attached to this. But I got wondrous stuff on my channel. Please check it out. Please give me a sub. And I will see you on the next one.